Hello. Ah, oh, aren't you just super fly? No, thank you. You look great too. Thank you. I appreciate you. My Come goodness. On, smile. Yes, smile. You know, <laughs> you too. You too. Um, I've had the opportunity to to interview you years ago when yes, I was. I uh, yay! I yay. remember. I never forget. Yes. You. Oh, awesome! Yes, great lady. And we're, yeah, thank you. And we're sorority sisters. My yes. sorority, oh, Alex, yeah. Alex, Alex Skewy. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Love it. <laughs> So happy to have you on, Brandy. How, how, how are you doing during, yes, how are you doing during this quarantine? How are you holding up? I'm, I'm doing good. We're holding up. We're holding up pretty well. My family yes. is with me. We've just been, um, I've been saying this a lot, but we've been spending a lot of quality time together and just hanging out as much as we can and yeah. just trying to stay creative, trying to stay active and you know, I'm just excited about the song in this time. I was able to release a song in this, in this yeah. crazy time. Yeah, but yeah, so yeah, that's good. That's good. So, yeah. so b baby mama featuring yes. Chance the rapper is here finally. Yes, right, right. Tell us about the process and what was the motivation behind the lyrics of the I song. Know. I know. I had a vision for a while. You know, I wanted to do a song uh, just celebrating my motherhood. I love being a mother for my daughter. She's She's the inspiration for my life. She's my entire world. So I wanted to do a song about that and then celebrating, you know, all mothers, but of course the single mothers who I don't think get the credit that they deserve. You know, people out there working two jobs to provide and just be that light for their, for their seeds. And I just, I just felt like this was the perfect song to celebrate, you know, Absolutely. the women that, that go through things like that. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you, you, you have raw lyrics in here. Yeah. Um, was it, is it, was it your, um, was it the purpose for you to kind of take the stigma away oh, from course. what baby mama yet means? Yes, yeah. absolutely. Because, um, you know, all baby mamas are not with the drama. All baby mamas don't want to, you know, cause no problems. We just want to do whatever it takes for our, for our children to succeed, to live a, a healthy life. And, and I just, I just wanted to be a, a new voice for that and give the single moms a voice and, and all yeah. mothers, you know, because this is a great, great position to be in, to be in to be an example for, for, for someone to look up to you and, and yeah. look to you for guidance. I mean, it's just a great thing. It keeps me on my toes. Yeah. Are you a mom? I am too. Oh. I have two girls. Come so on, we, girl. we're right there together. Yeah. yeah. So you feel yeah. me then. You are. Exactly. <laughs> because you never know, like if you're, you know, if you're getting it right, if you know, was yes. oh, that the right thing to do? How have you grown as a mother over the years? Um, it's trial and error. You know, of course, there there are books now on how to be a mother, but I mean, life is is the best teacher, and yeah, I've just I've just been able to uh, just connect with the with the best parts of myself to be everything that I need to be for for my daughter. And you know, what you show, your behavior, all of that is is how you teach. And yeah, I've just been trying to stay on point as much as possible. And it's and it's challenging. I have my days. You know, I'm I'm pretty sure you. You know, yes. you know, it's not it's not easy being a mom. It's not always easy to to walk in that in, in the brightest light. But mm -hmm. you you, you got to do what you have to do. Yeah. yeah. Bring you back to center. I just I just love it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what, what's the best piece of advice that you've received, maybe from your mother or another mother uh, on being a mother? The best piece of advice? I think communication has been some of the best advice I, I've been able to get from my mom, just staying open in communication, um, always come from a place of love, uh, to remember that I was once a child and, you know, try to try to do some things different and, and, and understand from, from the child perspective and, and understand that my, my daughter is a human being and she's her own person and I don't right. own her. I'm just here to help facilitate, you know, in, in her life and, and show her how to uh, depend on her, herself. Yeah, you know, yeah. I think that's really important, and and try to try to uh, nurture her confidence. Yeah, you yeah. know what I've discovered as a mother. Um, you know, we take good things and we take the things that we want to tweak from my own mothers. And Absolutely. What I do for my daughters is I apologize oh, a lot yes. more than I heard that from my mom. Oh, no. <laughs> that's a right? joke. I'm I'm shocked that I didn't think of that because that is something that I I practice. You know, because you you never want to have this perfection you know, you make mistakes as well. And if you make mistakes, you, you should apologize. And I think forgiveness, all of it is just all a part of, 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 of that bond that you share. Yeah, yeah. So I'm glad when, you brought that up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. <laughs> when you look at your daughter, um, what, what is the, what's the thing what, what, that brings you the tears as far as 
pride is concerned when you look at her? Um, her spirit. She's such a good person. She's a good friend and she loves music. The way she loves music, the way she um, just appreciates it. It just reminds me of when I, when I first started, you know, discovering that how much I love music and, you know, I, just to watch her grow in that, in that light is just, it's been such a joy for me because yeah. you know, we, that's like, music is everything to me. So to see her uh, just develop in that way, you know, it's just been, it's been such a treat to watch. Wow. Wow. Yes. It's beautiful. It's beautiful to watch your admiration and your tone change thinking of yeah. her. And I think that's, I think that's the beauty of motherhood. We, we yeah. have those moments where you're like, man, I'm, I'm doing something right. <laughs> yeah. She has me in the palm of, of her hand. For sure. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So, so what was the decision to tap Chance for this uh, particular song? Chance the well, You know, Chance is a, is a family guy. And we actually, um, we met on FaceTime. He wanted to do something with the I Want to Be Down song, the first song I ever I ever uh, dropped. And um, he was just telling me about his experience with his wife and, 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 their, and their family and their children and how they all came back together and their bond. And, and I was like, you know what? He would be great for baby mama. Yeah. I mean, he was just the perfect match for that. And, and he didn't even know about it before he told me all this stuff. He told me about his family and, and you know, their struggles and I just felt like he was the perfect artist for it. And then when I heard his verse, I was like, yes, I'm so glad I made that decision because he just, right. he just went in. I was he like, yeah, I, knew, I knew he was gifted and he was, you know, Chance the Rapper and all that, but he really just blessed the, blessed the song with such a great he, verse. And people are yeah, like, he did. yes, his contribution. That's good. Yes. When you look back on your, your career, um, Brandy, you, you've had such a successful career and you've been mm -hmm. open about everything. Um, I talked to so many singers, like mm -hmm. just reputable singers. They always reference you as one of their most favorite vocalists. Yeah. What is it about? What is so special? I want to hear from you. What do you feel is so special about your voice and your vocal arrangements that make people quiver? That is so weird for me to answer that. <laughs> um, someone, I can tell you what. Um, what LaShawn Daniels told me that it completely changed my, my life because I, I didn't really understand, you know, what was it? Like, why are people, you know, saying this about me? Like, what is it? Like, I know I can sing, but I, I just, what is it? You know, I don't have like the, the crazy range and, you know, that powerful, powerful chest voice and all this other stuff. But he said, it's your tone. It, it's the, it's the way you sound when you sing a song, you make yeah. the song your own. And, and um, and I think that that's it. I want to go with what he said. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you most proud of in, in your career so far? Um, I'm I'm proud that I that I still have um so much love for what I do, and I never want to stop doing what I, what I love to do. And I'm so glad that I have found a a, a new purpose in in my in my journey in my career like i'm here to be a vessel and to inspire people and to uplift people and to relate and it just that is that's what it's all about it's not so much about you know being popular and you know all that's great and that comes with it but it's about touching people yeah and, and that that's what i'm here to do yeah and it How makes me feel it? like what i do is not in vain yeah with that perspective <laughs> How long did it take you to, to gain this type of perspective? I mean, I know life comes at us so fast, but was it, it a does. gradual thing or was it an aha moment? Definitely gradual, definitely gradual. And I've had a, a, a beautiful aha moments, but um, it, it, it took me a while to get to this, to, to get to this place because, you know, I've, my life has been up and it's been down, you know, I've gone through so many things. So um, to be here now and to really, walking my truth and walking my light is just um it's a great feeling yeah and and <laughs> you is. look good and you thank look good you. while you're doing thank it. you <laughs> <laughs> absolutely so later this year you will have a new album I and will. I, yes and you know i hate the whole proverbial question what what can we expect from your what album i know <laughs> it's so hard to describe right right but what's what's new with brandy with this particular album that we have not seen before well, I'm doing a lot of lot more of the writing and producing. You know, I've I've worked with a great team that has been so open to all of my ideas and all of the you know the things that I've wanted to sing about. And it's a very personal, um, 
probably one of my most authentic albums to date. And, and that's what I'm so proud of. And I, and I just can't wait to share it. And that's why I'm working so hard and so meticulous about everything because I just want for it to really register in the hearts of people the way yeah. it was registered in mine. And I just love being able to be vulnerable and honest and music is such a great outlet for me to, 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 be, to be that way. Yeah. Um, and I feel very brave going forward. It's a brave yeah. thing to share your music. It really yeah. is. Yeah, it is. I've been it's so that. personal. Right, right. So how do you make sure you don't become attached to the outcome, but knowing that you're staying true to who Brandy is, no matter what the response may be? That can be difficult. But I, I've, I've been doing it for so long and I've, and I've had so many different experiences with, you know, different projects where, you know, I'll expect this to happen. It won't happen. And, you know, disappointments and things like that. But again, my, my perspective has changed. It's, it's yeah. not so much about me. It's about it's about everyone else that I'm sharing it with, you know. Yeah. So as, as long as I reach the people that I'm supposed to reach, I, I've done my I've done my job. Yeah, that's it. That's no. it. Yeah. I love the video to Baby Mama, too. Shout out to Derek Blank. I know. Yes. Derek Blank's killed. Frank Gatz and all of the USC dancers that I got a chance to work with. Um, just everybody just brought their A game. And we just had so much fun. So all the young girls representing the daughters and the, the women that are dancing with me representing the Baby Mamas. We just we just really had a good time dancing yeah. and paying homage to Sammy Davis Jr., just Bob Fosse, all of these great artists that that have paved the way for me and for all of us. So yeah, I'm glad yeah. you like it. Yeah, I do. It's really, it's fun. It's beautiful. It's like, it's colorful. And you look, you look so happy. You Thank look like you, like you're enjoying what you're doing. Thank you. I thought I looked too happy. I didn't, I didn't feel like I had that swag. Like I got my, you know, but I, I, I couldn't, I couldn't hold it. I was so yeah. smiling from ear to ear. Yes, <laughs> and you should, and you should. Obviously that happened before, you know, you shot that before the, the quarantine. Yes, uh, of course. Yeah, was, mm -hmm. was put into place. You know, I've been asking this to, to everybody that I get a chance to interview, huge stars like yourself. Um, how are you going to re-enter once this is all over? What, how do you want to be different um, than when you went into the quarantine? Well, I, I feel like I'm already different. I feel like, you know, I, I've been able to just appreciate the, the smallest things, like to be here with my family and to just to, to appreciate that every single moment that I spend with them and to be grateful. It, it's just been wow. The, you know, just I feel like I'm definitely in a in a state of gratitude and I mm -hmm. want to stay that way. It feels better to be thankful for what everything that you have for the pillow that I have to sleep on, you know, just just the smallest things, the water, yes. the cranberry juice, you know, <laughs> just, just the smiles and the time that I, just all of it. It's just it's great. It's yeah, great. yeah. So I want to keep that up. Yeah. The world yes. seems like it's a little bit quieter and I like that. Yeah. I think more that, peace. you know, that more peace, more love. Mm -hmm. And I literally have been um, meditating on the word gratitude. So the fact that yes. you said that, no, I know that there's a universal connection. Yes, there of course. Of you course. Know, gratitude is everything. You can't go anywhere without being thankful for what you, you have. And when yes. you're so thankful, you get more to be thankful for. Yes, you know, people absolutely. don't understand that. You appreciate yes. a penny, you can have it all. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Well, I am grateful and thankful for your time today to oh, hang out with too. us on oh, Magic. You are yes, so pretty. It's just, it's just. <laughs> thank amazing. you. You're welcome. So are I know you. you get that all the time. <laughs> but, well, thank you. I I'm grateful for God's yes, grace. Come on, girl. Grace. grace. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and you as well. Continue success on everything. Uh, I know, baby mama is is perfect, especially going into Mother's Day. This is yes, about happy to be Mother's Day. Day. Yes. Same to you, same Thank to you, you. Thank and much you. love and continued success. We're all watching. We've been watching from the very beginning and continue to be an example that you are. We love you, Brandy. I love and you guys, it. too. Yes. I appreciate Thank that. You guys download Baby Mama, stream it, <laughs> follow me. I'm, I'm around, so. Yes, she is. Yes, God I've been following you. you. <laughs> God bless you as well, sis. Take, take care of yourself. Okay. Bye. All righty. Bye. 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 Bye.